Welcome to High Alchemist. I'm your host Chakra and I am here to make a video. Basically, it's been a while. What's up with you guys? Um, my journey on enlightenment. Um, my journey in life, man. Man. Um, you know how, like how I've already explained, um, we are sacred geometry. We are like that movie Lucy. You guys remember that movie Lucy? You guys need to watch that movie. Like, it's true to a certain extent. You know what I mean? Um, because if you think about it, we all started out as an egg, right? And we all multiplied. Um, what do they say? Like at one point, um, like uh, we're not so different, like from like other things on Earth, like. The embryos kind of look all the same from like humans to like I forget what other species on earth right so it's like we're not too different not so different you and I um so yeah so we all start out started out as eggs you know just and I, I was explaining this to uh to um at the supermarket you know not too long ago man and I kind of blew their mind a little bit and I, I, this is what I was saying um and you know everything is made out of atoms you know you have to think about that and uh it's like that movie Lucy, you know, to a certain extent, you know, I don't want to go too, you know, um, crazy into it, but we all had to um, build bones in this freaking space time continuum, freaking, I don't know what we're living in vacuum in, right? So here we are, man. Um, my now is your now, you know, it doesn't matter when you watch this video, at what time might be it's always now like you can watch this video tomorrow and my now right now will be your now 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 it's always now so you know um uh i'm gonna i'm I, and i really want to go into it a little bit more um talk about uh the yin yang and uh i'm i'm really i'm and i want to i want to write um, I want to at least outline a little bit um, to it um, just to kind of like hone in on um, you know what I'm trying to say um, and really uh, but sometimes it's just like it comes in you know naturally you know like the flowing river type um, so the yin yang for instance you know there's, there, there's the yin yang you know let me just connect the dots just throw some dots out there you can see the picture right there's the yin yang, um, and these are all like um, examples, like uh, like that you can apply, like like blueprints to like explain something that's kind of an unexplainable type of thing, or not really unexplainable, but like just I don't know what I'm trying to say. You'll see, you'll see. Um, so the yin yang is uh, the good, the bad, and then there's the bad and the good, and the good and the bad, right? There's the white, the black. And then there's the white dot with the black dot and the black with the white dot, right? And then there's the whole thing, just perfect balance, right? You can apply that to a lot of things. Um, and this is kind of funny, but this is also, I mean, and you see this in a lot of, um, like, with the rings and, like, just powers, right? Powers, power, magic, you know, it's real to a certain extent, you know? And uh, you might not, you might laugh at that and you might say, what magic is real? Like, are you serious? What? So metaphysics, right? Where do you go when you go to sleep? You gotta think about it. Like, I'm not saying completely agree with what I'm telling you and like, yes, magic is real, believe that. If you don't believe it, like get the hell out of here. No, I'm not saying that. I'm saying that, and let me just go off on a little tangent. Like, there's always like uh, crazy religious people, and they're like, da, 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 da. and then when I'm like, okay, or I'm like, okay, so I'm like, if Jesus is Christ, magic is real, right? You know, because if you think about it, like Moses and Moses as well, right? He was uh, before Jesus himself, right? And he, they all had powers, right? So we all can achieve that to a certain extent, I believe, at least as well. I haven't because I don't like spend all my time like sitting like a monk you know achieving like levitation to a certain point right but we all have chakras and we all you know uh we all have energy man and and this comes into 
uh, w w what I said uh, earlier of uh, how everything is made out of atoms. You know, if you look at that world and how we interact with this universe, it's nothing futz. You know, if anybody has seen that movie, uh, Little Dicky or was it, uh, Dicky Roberts, former child star, or something like that. That movie's that's a great that's a great flick. Um, but yeah, so the yin yang is one thing where you can apply that to it, and uh, as well another one. And then I went off on little tangents. Um, so magic is real, I believe, right? Because it's like religion and all that. Like where's where's Moses? Moses, you know, right? There's Christianity and there's like all a bunch of like Christ, when Christ died, a whole bunch of religions were were created, right? Like I, I got Buddha, like as as a tattoo. Like I believe in Jesus. I believe in every religion. I've researched every religion, try not to go too crazy, um, in retrospect, you know, um, and I get why at 33, like, he did so much, because I'm 31 now, and I'm like, damn, in two years, imagine if I would have just went with it even more, and not just stuck, st thank God for the internet, if it wasn't for the internet, honestly, I had to literally, I had, I had to go to Nepal, or like, just sit down with gurus and type. I, I did that shit from the from my home. From like anybody can just be anybody can use the internet for anything, you know. And this ties in perfectly with what I'm trying to explain, which is my second uh, thing that I'm trying to tell you is that like the yin yang can be one thing that you can apply, kind of like blueprint to to things if you know what I'm trying to say. Um, and also the and this is why I said it was funny before I went to all, into all those tangents, um, is that it's, I, I got it from Pac-Man. And Pac-Man is a, a freaking video game, but it's it's pretty dope, you know? Like I said, you see it in movies with, you know, the, the, the superpowers, uh, like that they use like rings to like open portals. And, you know, science actually has proven that there are magnetic portals you know that it, even black holes for instance like if we have the ability to like have you seen that movie interstellar like dude i know these are just movies <laughs> like woman i know these are just movies earthling you know shout out to any outside beings i have no idea what to call you because i don't know what you look like and you know but i know you you can understand me you know and i know that <laughs> right um so my point is um that you need to be aware of uh, where you were born and uh, just not so much just why you're here and why like all this yeah it's cool and all like it's just I don't even know like it's just I don't even think we do know you know and I don't even think we're going to know maybe we do, we know a little bit once we like once I leave because my body honestly is just a pet like my body is just a pet and and what i mean by that is my consciousness is how can i explain this for instance think about think about a pet like it's just something that you had that you can make move and you know like a pet right like think about me as my think about look at my body right now think about it as my whole consciousness and my whole essence and my whole everything right because it's like a uh, spirit soul consciousness mind memory what else the five senses if you know of anything else like that's pretty much what we are and other than that it's like the body and like flesh and the physical right so if i just take like a little like that's just i don't know how to explain it i hope you you know i hope i haven't lost you but my point is my body is a pet that i can that I have that i have to, I have to take care of you know and and my my essence me is way bigger than i i don't know what you know than anything that we can imagine and that goes for you know the rest of like what isn't attached to the body itself you know because when for instance when i go to sleep it looks like i'm just laying on the floor right just laying there on the floor and i'm just like and it looks like i'm damn near dead but i'm not 
because I'm still breathing. And there's a whole bunch of things. Like there's the, the reptilian brain that you need to also control as well because it's like that's part of like earth like the 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 chakras like the root chakra and it, it just stems right it goes up you know from the seed you know to the root to the to to all the way to the moon you know what i mean so you gotta think about you know where you where you're living you know your environment and um how your environment might make you react you know and you know this i'm going off into tangents but my point is my 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 other idea my other uh blueprint my other analogy my other whatever however whatever you want to look at it however you want to see it is the pac-man right the pac-man and what i mean by that is that you go through one door and you come out the other you know and this is what i where i went off and uh you know what i was talking about and uh and uh, how science actually, science scientifically is like, that's just, nowadays it's like proven, you know, a couple years, maybe not so, but, and, and they're starting to believe, you know, in other dimensions and, uh, you know, and, and a lot of people don't, but it's, you know, before it was like, it's not scientifically proven. Now it's scientifically proven. There are portals to other worlds, other dimensions might be real. This just literally is just like a, cosmic soup it's like a cluster freak of a whole bunch of stuff you know what i mean um you have to think about the time that you're living in as well you know uh time is a tricky thing for instance another scientifically uh fact another thing that's like tangible while it's untangible at the same time it's like the the dateline for instance and i've made a video on this as well on this channel the dateline from for instance if you go from la to sydney you lose it's a it's it's weird so it's 15 16 hours right or something like that but it's like you lose a day it's a 16 hour flight but you lose a whole day when you cross the international dateline so you literally like get there two days later or before or some bullshit like that look into it it's real all of these things are real so the yin yang you know i believe that's from china chinese people are awesome they invented fireworks they they have thousands of years of culture of spiritual culture of it's, it's a beautiful thing over there a lot of cultures on this world on this beautiful planet um our differences are amazing we should learn from them not you know try to understand you know not be so afraid or just hateful or i don't know what i'm trying to say but i get it i get it um i'm not perfect as well but this is just where i'm at throwing words out letting you in my mind letting all letting all you in my mind um but yeah it's it's crazy the and it's kind of crazy but it's kind of like it's real um and you 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 I don't, I don't know I, I can't think of how i can explain the the pac-man the because sometimes just think about this sometimes you're going to be faced with i don't know what it is but in obviously right i'm like sounding like a damn fortune cookie but my point is it, the blueprint of like the yin yang with the good and the bad and all that good, right so think about the the door of pac-man right when you go through one door you come right back out the other it's like you're trying to figure something out right you're going through the maze you're figuring it out and then all of a sudden you go through one door but you don't know right the first time you go through that door you think you're gonna get somewhere but you're gonna get right back to where hopefully you didn't start there hopefully you just started at one point sporadically you know spawned in a game see how this is all coming to play here we are ladies and gentlemen welcome to earth um i appreciate you guys for stopping by i'm not gonna bore you it's like 14 minutes in um i'm just gonna leave this whole clip up uh love you guys please make sure to like comment subscribe hit the bell notification and all that good stuff hold your boy down 
um this channel is growing slower than my other channels because it's about woke stuff and all that good stuff but um i'm gonna start posting more like conspiracy stuff like i don't care man like i'm like instead of just keeping it straight woke and just like enlightening like life is a whole bunch of things man like it's i'm not gonna just stick with the light you know we need to learn how to like maneuver in the darkness you know and this is what my whole tattoo is about you know if you haven't seen that video and you know you want to go ahead bro like light up the darkness you know um i'm gonna get a new one soon on the other side right here you see that line yeah got the muscles coming in i'm acting a little egotistic right now but i got basically this bar right here that i'm gonna get and it's gonna say i got soul and i'm super bad oh i gotta get it with light of the darkness so light of the darkness and i mean these words as well and like it's super deep as well but it's also like when people ask me like oh what does that mean because especially when i see their tone like their you know i can't explain it you know i say oh it's a bob marley because it's light up the darkness bob marley right and uh, um, I got soul and I'm super bad, obviously. Bobby Brown, you know, Mr. Brown. Oh, um, um, James Brown. Excuse me, I'm like, that ain't Bobby Brown. That's James Brown, but yeah. Love y'all. Deuce.